Hi, I'd like to show you how to evaluate a function. Given a function f of x equals 3x squared minus 2x plus 2 for f of negative 1 and f of 1 third. Remember, when we're trying to evaluate a function, what we're representing is, remember, our x is our input variable, all right? And our function is going to be what we input, and then you're going to get an output. So x is going to be our input variable. So if I say, if I want to solve for f of 1, f of negative 1, what I'm going to do is I'm going to input that negative 1 into my function wherever I see the x. So therefore, I'll write f a negative 1 would equal 3 times negative 1 squared minus 2 times negative 1 plus 2. Therefore, you can notice this negative 1 has now replaced every spot where I had the x in my original function. Now, from here, it's just a simple of uh, simplifying uh, this equation. So, I have everyone equals negative 1 squared and becomes a positive 1 times 3 plus 2 plus 2. F, and, uh, F of negative 1 equals 3 plus 2 is 5 plus 2 is 7. Then, now let's say I want to input a different variable. So, therefore, now I'm going to get a, hopefully, a I'm going to get a different value because it is a function. Uh, I'll get a different value. So f of one third is going to be equals three times one third squared minus two times one third plus two. And actually, just correct myself. You won't necessarily always get a different term. However, this f of negative one since it's a function, if you guys remember. This f of negative 1, 7 is my unique answer. I cannot have a separate answer for f of negative 1. Therefore, it won't be a function, right? Remember, we went over functions. If you have your input, if you have two different outputs, it's not a function. So why theoretically I still could get a 7, I can't get a different answer when I input negative 1. Same thing, I can't get a different answer if I, when I put in 1 third. I will only get one unique answer because it's a function. So 1 third squared f one third equals three times one ninth minus two thirds plus two. Three times one third is going to be one third minus um, one third minus two thirds will become a negative one third plus two. F one third equals one and two thirds. Alright, so to remember how to evaluate a function, um, what you need to do is just take whatever your input variable is and plug it in for your given variable into your function and then simplify mathematically as given. So that's how you evaluate a function.